This is how we make French toast. One egg. Usually makes at least two or so slices. Some milk. Use two eggs if you're hungry. Uh, a little bit of milk. About that much, yeah. Start melting some butter in your pan. Hand butter. About a tablespoon. Yeah, then get some vanilla. Yum, vanilla. About a teaspoon. Yeah. Some awesome cinnamon. About a teaspoon. You stir that shit up together? I.e. beat the crap out of it. Piece of bread. See? The firmer your bread, the better. Otherwise, it'll get all soggy and See? Warm fall apart. Side. Oh, look at that awesome cinnamon. Mmm. Where are they? We had about a tablespoon butter pan. And we got our French toast slice. Right there. Medium high heat. If you know what French toast looks like, cook it until it looks like that. Until it's brown. Yep. Oh, that cinnamon smells fabulous. Mmm, so is the vanilla. I know. See, it's not really done yet. See, just wait a little bit longer. So it's good to use. Oh, ah, yeah. Takes a little bit, not too long. Hit that sizzle a little bit up. There we go. And then you just kind of got to be patient. It doesn't take too long. But you want to make sure it's cooked all the way through. Otherwise you have raw egg in the middle. Blech. Ooh. Smells like French toast. Oh yeah. Sometimes I like to do flipping back and forth. Just to do a double check on it. Because I don't like to bite into raw egg. Well, you also don't want burnt toast. Yeah. Wow. Oh, that. see? Perfect. Perfection. Perfection. Okay. And that's how you make French toast. Yeah. Serve it with whatever you like. A little syrup or a little confectionery sugar. Or eat as is. And that's your kitchen ecstasy for the week. Bye. Have a good time.